Hello everyone. Now in this tutorial we will see this break surface or curve option in the operations toolbar. By using this option we can break surfaces or curves. See this is break surface option. You have to select the element. Element is nothing but the set of curves or surfaces to be cut and limitation is nothing but the set of limiting elements, points, curves, planes or surfaces. This is the break curve option. Here also the selection is same. You have to select the element to be cut and a limiting element that is cutting element. Here I am selecting a surface and limitation as these curves. Now if I say apply let me choose this face trim option so that entire surface will be visible and you can select the surface region that you want to keep just click on the region that you want to keep and the rest of the surface will be gone see I have selected three portions and you can see the rest of the surface has cut so this is how you can break the surface select the surface and select the cutting element say apply right click on this and if you choose this keep all but this then rest of the surface will be kept and the selected region will be gone select the surface select the cutting elements the surface and curves is not necessary to be in contact with each other if you select the fragment then limitation selection will be off and the surface will be broken by its segment boundaries limitation selector will be inactive when you select the fragment option select the surface select the cutting elements see now this is the direction of cutting if you select the along compass then it projects along the compass direction cutting will take place along the compass direction this is normal normal direction to the specific region of the surface in the normal direction and this is the along viewing direction cutting take place perpendicular to the screen Now let's see what is this face trim and surface trim. This is the face trim. In the face trim, control points of the initial surfaces are kept. I have turned on this fifty display and you can see the control points of the initial surfaces are kept. Actually this is fragmentation button is on I will turn off this fragment and then I will say apply in face trim you can see the control points of the initial surface are kept not the resulting surface after breaking 
whereas this surface trim keeps the control points of the resulting surface the resulting surface after breaking see if you want to keep these three then control points of these three surfaces are kept see in this way so this is the difference between face trim and surface trim Now let's see one more example and try to understand this face trim and surface trim. I have selected a surface and cutting elements and I will select this face trim. See the control points of the initial surface are kept. See after breaking if I try to modify the control points or change the position then control points of the initial surface can be modified not the resulting surface if you select while breaking this face trim option